Our earlier videos showed that GAN's diagonal angles must be correctly scaled to the appropriate time domain if they are to have any value. This video will show how these angles closely track growth spiral expansion in the NASDAQ 100, ticker NDX. Steeper angles correspond with the expanding growth spiral. Using angle convergence to forecast market turning points is also studied, with the most recent July 2024 top as an example. As prices approach a dominant angle, the probability of a turn increases. When two or more angles are reached at the same time, the probability increases proportionally. The scientific basis of Cowan's growth spiral model is an extension of Albert Einstein's general theory of relativity and his theory of gravitation published in 1915. Einstein's geometric explanation of gravity, which uses the curvature of four-dimensional spacetime to form gravity wells, is commonly accepted by modern physics. There are many good sources for studying gravity wells and you can research this topic on the internet for a deeper understanding, if so desired. This image shows how a mass is pulled into a gravity well, or conversely, spirals out of it. Cowan's market science set of books, figures 13.8 and chart 13c, used his four-dimensional concept of price time to describe this torus, or donut shape. Cowan's model equates price with space from Einstein's model. A two-dimensional top view of the gravity well is a series of concentric circles, with the central point being the center of the well. A mass achieving escape velocity spirals out to the larger circles. Electron orbital shells of the atom are also modeled this way, with the electron moving out to the next shell as energy is added to the atom. Gravity well theory similarly explains the expanding energy levels found in the stock market, as time progresses. Price displacements, measured by the circumference of the circle, increase as the growth spiral moves farther from the center. Time is the angular displacement, and is the same for the small circle near the center, as it is for the larger circles farther away. GAN's diagonal angles are the tool we use to measure these expanding energy levels. As energy increases to new levels, and the growth spiral arcs upward, the GAN angles become progressively steeper. GAN's square of 9 is a similar model, with price and time defined by movements around the circles. Larger price swings happen on the circumference of the larger circles for the same time intervals, or angular displacement. Our stock market example looks at the NDX after the 2009 bottom. This cycle started slow for the first seven years because, to paraphrase George Bayer, the baby has to learn to crawl before he can walk. The first angle selected is the 1 by 4. As you can see, without the proper scaling, this angle has no value, because the market is not operating in the daily time domain. But with scaling set to 6.5, for hourly computations, the trend clearly followed this angle for 7 years. When you are working with earlier periods, like 1929, you use the weekly energy level by setting points per bar to 1 on a weekly chart. Growth began to accelerate 44 months into the cycle, after the 2013 bottom. At this point in time, the seeds for the next higher energy level, the 1 by 2, were planted. Remember this 2013 bottom. It will be shown that years later many major turns aligned with angles drawn from this bottom. This 1 by 2 remained the dominant angle for another 44 months, until the bottom in 2016, when the 1 by 4 from 2009 was finally touched for the last time, and the energy increased to the 1 by 1 angle. At the 2019 bottom, additional energy pushed the growth rate up to a 2 by 1 rate, which hit the major top in 2022. Energy levels deflated after the 2022 top, and the NDX dropped down to the 1 by 2 that originated 10 years earlier, in 2013. This marked the 10-year cycle low from 2013, the 7-year cycle low from 2016, and the 4-year cycle low from 2019. New energy entered the system in 2023, and the angle increased to the 4 by 1. The probability of a reversal increases as price approaches an angle. 
In the rare instance that price arrives at a point where multiple angles converge, the probability of a turning point greatly increases. The greater the number of converging angles, the greater the probability. The most recent five years of data shows how multiple angles converged at the recent July 2024 top. The 45 drawn from the 2022 top, which originated at the same 2013 bottom studied earlier. And the 2 by 1 drawn from the 2020 COVID low. And the 4 by 1 from the 2023 low. And, most recently, the nearly vertical 1 by 8. The turning points are labeled for simplicity. The dramatic decline, BC, extended between the 1 by 1 and the 4 by 1 angles from D. BC also dropped between the 1 by 1 and the 1 by 2 drawn from E, the 2013 bottom. A little mental exercise shows why Fibonacci works in measuring market retracements. With the price tool set to Fibonacci, BC was almost exactly 0.62 of AB. BC was also 0.38 of FB. All three points, A, B, C, fall on angles converging at the higher energy level at D. B and C are also on angles drawn from the lower energy level at E, forming the triangle EBC. As energy came out of the system at B, prices dropped to the lower energy level at C, much the same as the electron drops energy shells, as energy leaves the atom, and a photon is emitted. Golden triangle decomposition was followed when energy left the system, and the side of each lower energy level was reduced by 0.62. If you found this video useful, you can subscribe below to be notified when new material is presented, or review the material at cycle-trader.com, which is the only legal source for Cowan's books and software.